Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lily. It is nice to meet you. And if you're not new here, welcome back. Last week, last Wednesday, I dropped a serious bomb on y'all. Just spontaneously decided to upload my why I left school video. So there's that. It was definitely something I expected to get a lot of views and like a lot of people to watch and like talk to me about and stuff. And I was definitely right, but it for sure exceeded my expectations. Like, I was expecting maybe 200, 300 views. I think it's almost at 600 now. And that is just kind of like blowing my mind that like 600 people have watched that video. I know both my parents shared it on Facebook. My grandparents shared it on Facebook. I've had friends put it on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, and just kind of like promote me and stuff, which I thank you guys for. It just means a lot that you guys like care about what happened and cared enough to share it and get the word out about stuff like that. But today is just going to be a really kind of fun video, like a sillier video. It is just going to be a random questions that I find on the internet Q&A. So just random questions. And I've skimmed through these questions but haven't really like picked certain ones out. I'm just going to go through them and just like, I'm like, all right, this one sounds good. This one sounds good. And it'll also probably turn into a little bit of a story time, like where I'm explaining things. So I think you guys will enjoy that. So let's just get on in. The first question is, are you in love? No, no, no time for that. Next one, do you like coffee? Absolutely, but I have been, recently I've been drinking more iced espresso because it's warming up and I was in Florida and stuff like that. So I was drinking a lot of like iced lattes, stuff like that, iced macchiatos, whatever. And iced espresso has been hurting my stomach. I was reading somewhere and like I had someone that's in the medical field tell me that espresso, when you drink too much of it, like drinking it in excess, like strips your stomach lining and is like really bad for your stomach. So I tried to kind of tone it down. Like every time I would go to Starbucks, I tried to get like just an iced coffee or a tea or something of that nature like yeah an occasional like latte cold brew whatever but i would try to stick to things that like were probably better for my health rather than going straight to espresso the last movie i watched um what are you eating now nothing i just had some teddy grams though those were pretty good who is your best friend um, I'm gonna have to go with Lindsay. She's just an OG. What is my favorite pet? Hazel, my dog. I'm just gonna choose a random one. Do you miss anyone or anything right now? I miss Target. I could go for some Target right now. Um, worst injury I've ever had. That was cliff jumping, rope swinging, whatever. Um, a few years ago. And I got a severe concussion from that. What is the size of my bed? A queen. Because a queen needs a queen. Actually, I'd prefer to have a king size bed, but it doesn't fit my room. But I go by the motto, sleeping like a queen in the California king I need. Lady Annabellum, y'all know what's up. But I don't have room for that. And that's fine. I really don't need a bed that big. Um, are you wearing pants right now? Yes, I'm wearing just gray sweat jogger, whatever. I'm being so lazy today, but it's a day after travel and I'm trying to get a lot of work done, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, next I'm moving to the um, funny tag questions. This is on tagquestions.net if you were interested. Are you a flirt? I can be. Do you cry in public? No, but I have been known to cry in Starbucks. Like, I think it's when I get to Starbucks, I'm like in work mode. I'm like, all right, let's grind, let's get it, let's let's get in the zone. And I've had like some bad stuff happen at Starbucks. Like, people will text me. Like just recently, I like had like a super important trip coming up that I was so excited for and they just like canceled it. 
and it was just like okay like it's gone and I was so upset and I just cried in Starbucks like not like sobbing but like I shed a tear you know um another time I had to do a PE assignment and something about it I don't even remember what it was now see crying doesn't help anything I don't even remember what I was crying about but it was a PE assignment anyway like it really offended me and I just started crying I don't really remember what it was about um do you cry in sad movies no I have never cried in a movie except for trolls I don't know why do you sing or dance in the shower I always play music when I'm in the shower so yes to both of those I don't really like you know have a full out dance party because you just need to wash and get out because we're not wasting water we're not trying to hurt the environment even more than people are already hurting it but sometimes you break out like a little dance movie no do you ask or answer stupid questions I always ask stupid questions when I'm like hyper and like in a really funky mood I'll ask people that I'm with like do you love me like weird why would I do that don't know would you give all your money to charity this is kind of tricky because I don't really know if this is classified as charity but I would give all the money that I have currently to Guatemala the association that I work with in Guatemala I would give every last penny to them and I think that's considered charity so yes can you spend all your money on something stupid I would never do that would you drop your phone after you just bought it well not on purpose do you smile for the camera when taking pictures? This is stupid. What's your religion? I'm a Christian, non-denominational Christian, and it's more of a relationship. It's not religion. What's your eye color? Green. I'm obsessed with my eyes. What are your hobbies? Shopping, 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 and traveling. Do you like joking a lot? Mm-hmm. I like to say things that get people really worked up and really excited and then just say, just kidding. It's my specialty. Do you want to get married? Mm, not anytime soon. Does love equal sex? No. Do you think you are old fashioned? Not at all. Would you prefer to be hurt by someone you love the most or by someone you trust the most? This is deep. Hold on, let me think. I think I'd rather be hurt by someone I love the most because someone I trust the most knows everything about me. Person I love the most, like I love my dog the most, but she doesn't know my deepest, darkest secret. Lindsay probably does. And if Lindsay hurts me, it's on. Remember the last time you were furious? What made you that angry? Do you feel different? I don't know, I try not to be really angry. Sometimes I get there, but I don't really remember. Imagine you are home alone, lonely and bored. Who would you like wish to be together with? Okay, well, right now I'm home alone because it is Tuesday at 1.35 p.m. I need to go to the gym, actually. That's what I need to do. But I am home alone right now. I'm not lonely nor bored because I have a lot of things that I need to be doing one of which is making these video um who would I like to be here with me nobody I don't know apart from romantic love when did you tell someone that you loved them when did you last tell someone that you loved them I told Lindsay like an hour ago I don't know Lindsay's really getting hit with the fame in this video hey girl you are to save your family member or your lover from drowning in the ocean. Who do you leave to drown to their death and why? I leave my lover because family over everything. What is harder for you? Facing someone when telling him or her the way you feel or facing someone when he, she is telling you the way. Oh, when someone is telling me the way they feel because I got a lot to say and they never give you time to say it. Okay. When heading to work, you encounter a situation that you need to help out. For instance, a cat got stuck in the top of the tree. Too bad, I hate cats. Um, your boss has threatened to fire you if you get late to work again. Do you risk the cat's life? Yes, I do not like cats at all. 
I'm sorry, I will call the fire department. Your boss wants to sack your coworker due to work shortage and he, she just got the job recently. You have been working there much longer. With a large family to support your coworker has no other source of income. Would you approach your boss and request to quit the job? I don't know. I don't have a job. Social media is my job. And I don't really have a boss, so. This is a good one. Are you the type of friend you would like to have as a friend? I definitely try to be. So, all my friends out there, do you think I'm a good pal? Comment down below. I want to know. Are you in debt? No. Although I do owe my grandma $30. But I'll pay her, like, tomorrow, I think. Summer or winter? Winter. How much do you earn? As much as I work for, sis. What do people like you for? My booty. What is your favorite cereal? Crave. I love Crave cereal, but I never eat it because it's bad for you and because I don't really like cereal that much. I eat it only once a year, two weeks out of the year when I'm in Northern Minnesota. How many people have you slept with over the last month? Do I talk to animals? I talk to my dog literally all the time. I'm like, Tuki. Are you hungry 24 seven? No, but when I get bored, the pantry starts crying. Ever peed in the woods? Multiple times. When did you last go shopping? I don't know. I went to Target like a few days ago. I think that was Saturday. Yeah. I went to Target on Saturday. Today's Tuesday. I miss Target like a lot. If I don't go every day, I'm like, having withdrawals. So that is all for this like funky little q and I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was just something kind of silly because last week's video was a little depressing. But thank you guys for all your love and support on that video. Even the haters who like the thumbs down, I love you guys too. I'll see you guys later. Bye. <laughs>